Now the Lord Jesus says to this man, Marvel not that I said unto thee, Ye must be born again. This man, you see, put up this mask, and he's losing it now. The mask of the ruler of the Jews is falling off. And the Lord Jesus said to him, Marvel not that I said unto thee, Ye must be born again. The wind bloweth where it listeth. Thou hearest the sound thereof, but canst not tell whence it cometh and whither it goeth. So is every one that's born of the Spirit. Now, you can't tell where the wind comes from. You can't tell where it's going. The air currents and the winds are something that man still doesn't know very much about. The wind bloweth where it wills. You can't change it. They're trying today to see down these hurricanes in the Gulf of Mexico and the Caribbean area. So far, they haven't done very much with them. They can't tame the wind. The wind bloweth where it listeth. Thou hearest the sound thereof, canst not tell whence it cometh, whither it goeth, so is every one that's born of the Spirit. Now, though you can't control the wind, you can sure tell when it's blowing. You and I can be standing out on the street, and you can say to me, well, the wind is blowing. I say, how do you know? You say, look at that tree up there. See how the leaves are blowing? And notice how the tree is bending over? You can tell when the wind is blowing. Now, friends, the ones born of the Spirit... I don't know how to explain to you the spiritual birth. Now, I know there are a lot of books out on that today to explain it. The difference between me and the fellows that write those books is just simply this. They don't seem to know they don't know. At least they're willing to admit, I don't know. The wind bloweth where it listed. I don't quite understand it. But that's the way the ones that are born of the Spirit. I can't tell you exactly how the Spirit of God operates, but I do know this. I can sure tell when he is moving in the lives and hearts of his people. And that's exactly what our Lord is saying here. Now, our Lord's got rid of the two masks. The man that stands before us is no longer the man of the Pharisees. And he's no longer the ruler of the Jews. And who is he? Listen to him. Nicodemus answered and said unto him, How can these things be? Now he stands there as just plain little old (laughs) Nicky. He now is asking the question, how can these things be? Now our Lord's going to talk to him very plainly. And by the way, you and I can put up our masks before each other. And there's so many people today that use them. They are with a certain crowd. They act a certain way. But the mask today, friends, hides just how we really are. Now, when you come to the Lord Jesus, you have to take off all your masks. You can't use them there. You have to be the real you. You have to come just as you are. Then the Lord will deal with you that way. And that's the way he dealt now with Nicodemus. 